learning affiliate marketing is pretty tough. And a lot of it is you have to actually self-teach yourself. It's such a new industry and the methods are constantly changing. Um, I actually decided to do a video about how to learn affiliate marketing. And I'm gonna kind of define the word affiliate and I'm gonna go over the major skills uh, that you need to know in order to become successful as an affiliate marketer and how to learn this skill, which is amazing and can afford you your freedom. Hey, I'm John Cristani, and last year from affiliate marketing, I made over $3.4 million. Last month alone, I actually made $691,000. Most of my income is from affiliate marketing. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can learn affiliate marketing. Now, I've been doing this since 2012, and I'm largely self-taught. This is not something that you'll find in schools, but it is a way to work for yourself and create your own freedom. Of, of location, being anywhere you want, and of, of time, you know, you can work whenever you want. And also, financially, you can make tons of money. I, you know, I, I made a couple million dollars last year. My friend, he runs an eight-figure business. He does about $24 million per year. And, you know, you can make whatever amount of money you want in this industry, so I'll be going over what you to do. So first off, the word affiliate, okay? The word affiliate, affiliate, what an affiliate marketer is, is you are selling someone else's product on a commission-only basis. So a good example of an affiliate marketer would be like Uber. Uber doesn't actually own uh, any cars, or they might now, but for the longest time, Uber didn't own any cars. They were simply connecting drivers with people who wanted to be driven around, and they, they provided a platform to connect these two parties, and they made a commission for the connection. Same thing with Airbnb or uh, Hotels.com. So Hotels.com doesn't actually own any hotels. They're simply connecting people who want to stay in a hotel with companies that own hotels. And they're making a commission for connecting those two parties. Or if you've ever booked a flight on Expedia.com, you know, there's people who want to take flights and there's plane companies. Expedia.com is an affiliate. They're just connecting those two parties and they're making a commission for that referral. So that's all affiliate marketing is. It's a very old business model. Nothing about affiliate marketing is unique or necessarily a trick. So what I'm trying to say is if you come across people or sites that say that this is a, you know, they have a trick or a hack or a or a special, you know, like hidden secret about affiliate marketing that you just press a button and make money, it's it's not real. Okay, the affiliate marketing is, it's, it's a business. It takes skills like anything else. There aren't secret hacks to what we're doing here. The second thing to understand is the difference of learning versus doing. Spend some of your time learning and you should spend a lot of your time doing, but some people substitute the fact that they are watching YouTube videos like you are right now for actually doing work and you're not going to make any money if you're just listening to YouTube videos. However, doing some learning will help guide you when it's time to take action and actually put things into practice. So make sure when you're learning, you're doing. Don't just watch YouTube videos and try to ingest all the information because that won't allow you to make money. What, you know, the best way to do things would be to watch a YouTube video, maybe two or three YouTube videos, and then put it into action. Or even just watch a YouTube video and then put that thing you learned into action. Set up that website, set up that squeeze page, set up that ad, you know, whatever you're doing. Do some research, etc. Now I'm known as a voracious action taker. One of my strong suits is that I've always been extremely proactive. Ever since elementary school even, my friends, you know, they, they, they knew I was always the guy down for whatever dare. They said, John, why don't you try doing this? I'd go and do it. And translating that into business has been very good for me because anything I learn, I put into action immediately. And it's largely resulted in a lot of business success. Now, the next things to understand are the top three skills for affiliate marketing. Yes, affiliate marketing is a skill based profession. It's not just a trick or a hack. The first skill is copywriting. 
Copywriting is the right brain thinking. Um, it's a little more of cre better for creatives or those who can easily empathize with others. And what copywriting essentially is, is being able to write words that make sense to people on the other end of the, the screen or the website or the computer that makes them want to take whatever their problem is and buy whatever solution it is that you are marketing. Copywriting is also called copywriting because a lot of it has to deal with copying things. Again, in marketing, it's not all about being creative. It's about taking a control. You wanna make sure you're always basing your marketing off of what's already working in the marketplace. That's why so many marketers have what's called a swipe file of already proven ads that they can draw information from and draw inspiration from when they're creating their own marketing messages or their own ads online. The next skill is more of a left brain thinking and it is data analysis. Data analysis is important because when you're setting up marketing campaigns and when you're putting up, you know, let's say you're going to market a skincare product and you put up five different ads with five different images, you know, maybe one image you show somebody, you know, an old lady with a turkey neck, you know, in another image you show kind of those, those crow's feet that, that appear at the uh, end, of your, end of your eyes when you get old. Uh, maybe in another image you kind of focus on the sun damaged skin on somebody's face or on their on the backs of their hands. Maybe on another image you just show a smiling, happy, beautiful older lady. Okay, so that would be an example of a good split test of five different images. In marketing, to understand what image is working best, what ad is working best, we need to make use of data analysis. Now, it's not complicated statistics, okay? This isn't, this isn't anything that is, you know, this isn't algebra we're doing here. It's simple numbers. It's simply understanding which ad is working better than the other. But in order to do this, you need to be comfortable looking at numbers. You need to be comfortable drawing conclusions from numbers and that goes into data analysis. Again, this isn't complicated, neither is this, but these are skills and you do need to learn them or hone these skills through, through experience as you're doing affiliate marketing if you truly want to become great. The next skill is a weird one, but it ties everything together and that's research, okay? Being able to be resourceful and do your own research is so paramount because all of the systems that we're using Facebook changes every week, or Facebook ads changes every week, Google ads changes every month. All of these softwares and platforms and, and the whole internet space evolve so rapidly, you really need to be able to be resourceful and be able to research things effectively. Now, just like you're doing right now, you're doing a sense of research. You're being resourceful in terms of finding your own information about affiliate marketing. Now, maybe this video just showed up in your newsfeed. It just kind of, maybe this video found you, so to speak. And if, if it did, give it, give it a big like. But if, you know, when you're actually decided and committed to pursuing affiliate marketing as your freedom profession, what's going to take you out of your job and create that financial and lifestyle freedom for yourself, you want to be intentional about things. And you'll need to be able to Google things to find out your own information on it. So, you know, I may not link you to a course about data analysis, okay? You're going to have to Google it and you're just going to have to look up maybe data analysis or, you know, for affiliate marketers, whatever. But you'll need to Google things as you go along. Let's say you're taking some training videos from me on my YouTube channel, you'll need to, you know, let's say Facebook ads looks different today than it did one month ago when I released my video on Facebook ads. So you'll need to kind of be able to poke around in the Google Facebook ads interface to figure out where that section was. Or you'll need to do control find to find where the ads manager was, uh, where it is now. Little things like that, or knowing, being proactive and being able to message a support desk um, to ask them a question. Or if you are taking my six-week training course um, about affiliate marketing, you'll need to be resourceful and post in our forum, message my support, um, be active on the weekly webinars, and uh, ask questions. These are things that will help you succeed. Again, proactively 
researching things and realizing that research, effective research is actually a skill and it's a very important one if you want to survive in this fast moving industry. So if you got something really cool from this uh, video, make sure to subscribe to my channel um, and also hit that notification bell and you will actually get access to a free course on affiliate marketing. And I also have some free mini courses on YouTube from some of my friends about topics such as copywriting, becoming an entrepreneur and other things that you can check out and spend time learning from. Now, if you have a question for me or anything related to this video, feel free to leave a comment in the comments below. If, you've, if you'd like me to go deeper into any one of those subjects, copywriting, data analysis, or research, name it in the comments below. Just say data analysis or copywriting or whatever that is, and I will make sure to do more videos in the future that go deeper into that subject. Thanks for watching and hopefully see you in another video and here's to your success. Let's make some money.